Greetings, Earthlings. Welcome to Planet and Alien here on YouTube. Welcome to my... Wait. Welcome to Planet and Alien. I already said that. Whatever. There's Tim. This is Tim. He's my alien boyfriend, you know. He wasn't as lucky as me. I got a human body. He got inflated into a balloon-like thing. But he's alright with that. Right, Tim? He's alright. No. Um, okay. So I want to talk about aliens. Now, really quick. Look at these babies. Aren't they the coolest shoes ever? They got fucking love your hands. And also, hashtag the struggle is real. It really is. Okay, so I have a conspiracy theory. Ooh, welcome back, guys. I have a conspiracy theory for you. Dun dun dun. No, um, but I told this one to my friend Maddie because she freaks out at the thought of aliens. Like, she knows they ex exist, but she's scared of them. And I'm just like, every time she talks, she gets freaked out, I'm like, the more you resist, the more they're going to want you. And it freaks her the fuck out. And it's funny to me. I don't know. It's just funny. But if you don't already know, I love aliens. I 100% believe in aliens. I would be abducted by an alien. If they wanted me to be abducted, I'd be like, hell yeah, take me. I mean, even back there, I got a license plate thing don't have a car but i got it because it had an alien on it i just love aliens you know i just love love aliens now this conspiracy theory as i was telling it to maddie she was like have you ever seen like area 51 you're like explaining movies you know this isn't a conspiracy theory it's something that is in movies and i was like well it's in movies maybe because it is fucking true but I'm still going to say my conspiracy theory because this is my conspiracy theory and I, I like it. Okay, so don't hate on me. I know, like, this has been shown in movies apparently and stuff, but, you know, it came to me. I want to talk about it. So, yes. Um, also, since I'm going to be posting this on YouTube, I'm going to be watching Riverdale episodes soon and making the video soon. I just need free time because I'm, I have a ton of homework I have to do for all my classes, study for two tests. So I'm probably going to watch Riverdale tomorrow, which is Saturday. I'll get up, I'll watch it, I'll make the video, and I'll be good to go. I hope you guys can wait. Maybe today if I have time, probably not, but m m most importantly tomorrow, because I will wake up, I will watch that episode, and I will fucking film what I have to say, because I'm ready to watch it, and I'm ready to say what I want to say. But I don't want to watch it, and then not be able to film the video for like a day or more, because then it's like I'm not in that... Riverdale mode where it's like I just finished the episode and I'm freaking the fuck out, you know? Okay, so Hold on Okay, I had to check something, sorry Okay, so my conspiracy theory aliens, okay, so the movie the fourth kind now that is based on true events Some may believe it some may not but it is based on true events Now that's not the movie that got me uh, Maddie, if you have seen these movies, VHS, it's basically a bunch of little movies put together into one of stories of how people die, of stories of zombies, of alien abductions, crazy ass fucking shit, let's just say that. So, there's three of them. The third one, well, that sucks so bad. But anyways, she had never seen VHS 2, so I was like, and she wanted to watch it, so I was like, alright, I've already seen it, I don't care, I'll watch it again, you know. Well, we were watching it, and, like, one of the last videos played is of these kids in their house, you know, and aliens come, and they're, like, what's so crazy is these aliens, like, you imagine, like, short green aliens, but, like, looking like that, you know, in the face and stuff, like, the big eyes and stuff, but the aliens in VHS 2, like, that is honestly how I now imagine aliens, because, like, they're, I mean, they're, we each are human in our own way. I mean, they're just a different type of human. So who's not to say they're not tall, taller than us because they're aliens on another fucking planet. Just saying. But these aliens are super fucking tall. But they really look like what aliens would look like. Like, that's what's scary about it. But, so what got me is these aliens are fucking drowning the kid and the, um dog they're eating one of the kids they're fucking abducting them all and they're crazy and they're attacking them and they're scary looking motherfuckers and so i watched that you know and the next day i came and i'm in the shower and i started thinking about it the movie because i started thinking about how i viewed aliens like that 
but how but then I started thinking about how I viewed aliens like that like I said and how the sh movie portrayed the aliens and that's where it started to come from and it's like what if that's what aliens really look like because like to me like for example aliens seem so cool they seem like they have this kind of look you know we have this perception of what they apparently look like or our perception of what we think they look like but in reality we don't fucking know what they look like and we also don't know if they're good or bad you know so that's the scary part so after watching this movie i started thinking and i started thinking about the people who have been abducted now whether you believe these people or not is your choice but these people who have been abducted and then reappeared the next day in a field not remembering anything is because now this is where the theory comes in is because that aliens are abducting humans and putting chips in their brain while also kind of getting inside the mind. Because you think about it, aliens, if they can have UFOs, they have crazy amounts of technology, like crazy amounts. So they could do anything to us and we honestly wouldn't know, you know? We don't know what technology they have. It's definitely better than our fucking technology. But anyways, so what if they're putting like chips in the brains of the humans they're abducting and they, so that they can watch humans and so they can study humans and so they can get a better understanding of humans and keep a watch over humans. Now, my friend Maddie said she thinks that the people who are getting abducted are not actually the ones coming down, but instead they're clones of the people that got abducted coming down. I don't know. I'd have to see a person who's apparently been abducted before and then after the abduct, uh, abduction to then determine. But my theory is that they're putting chips in the brain. They're like studying the brain, you know, kind of like dice going around our brain and shit. I don't know. I'm just saying they're doing that shit. So they're getting inside of like the human mind, putting chips in us and then dropping us back on planet Earth, on Earth, you know, and you don't remember anything, you don't think anything, you know, you're like, oh my god, I got abducted by aliens, but I don't remember anything, I remember, like, these people and light, and that's it, and then I w woke up in a field and stuff, so it's like, chips in the brain. Now, another thing, a lot of people claim to see UFOs, I've seen videos and pictures of things that look like UFOs, or videos where there's, like, this round thing in the sky with all these lights, and then suddenly, it's gone, like, and I do believe in aliens, so therefore I believe in UFOs. What if the UFOs that people are seeing in the sky are aliens watching us, you know, surveilling us, you know, kind of filming us, whatever you want to say, because eventually aliens are going to wipe out us and take over Earth, and I think the government knows something like this is coming. I think they do. Okay, that's one theory. Or aliens are going to take over Earth and make us their slaves. Or another theory, hold on, because I just lost it in my head. Okay, I, found, I remembered it now. Or another theory, the third one, is that they're going to abduct every human, maybe all at once or little by little, and keep the actual human being and bring down a clone, like my friend Maddie said, you know. But instead I'm using it in a different way and bring down a clone so that Earth will now be ruled by clones that aliens made of us and these clones they can control and are basically like aliens, you know? So, I know that sounds like, I don't know. I know I'm probably, you're probably like, oh, I've seen that in a movie or, okay, that's not really a conspiracy theory, but it's like, I don't know, I had, it was my, like, it came to me, I've never seen, like, because Maddie was like Area 51, but I've never seen that, so I don't know what the fuck, you know, happened in that movie. I've only seen a select few of Alien movies, like the, al I've seen all the Alien movies, like, oh, those are the best. But anyways, so like, I just, I don't know, I came up with this theory because I was, because it is kind of scary that... I imagine aliens in such a certain way, and I imagine them to be these awesome fucking species, but in reality, we don't fucking know what they look like, how they are, what they want. I mean, why, if these are UFOs in the sky, why are they up there? Why are they looking down on us so close? You know, why are they around? 
And why would people be making up that they got abducted, you know? And why would people not be remembering things or ending up in fields, you know? And it, honestly, it's smart. Put a chip inside their brain. You can control them. You can see through their eyes. So it's basically like aliens are getting to be humans without actually being humans. Or aliens are turning into said humans that get abducted and coming back down as that human but really it's not the person who got abducted it's just a clone that is now an alien clone and now they're living among us and little by little aliens are going to take over earth and i think the government kind of knows something like this is going to happen something like i see like an independence day thing happening like i swear to god i see like us going against aliens and like Maddie, Maddie's point was like, well, they have all this technology. Why would they wait? And it's like, we don't know. Like, I don't know. Like, they could be waiting for the right moment. They could be waiting until they control everyone. We don't know what they're waiting for. We don't know what they want, you know. But I just thought it was an interesting theory. I, I mean, you don't have to consider it a conspiracy theory or anything. But to me, it's a conspiracy theory about aliens, you know. And I just wanted to put it out there because it's something I thought about. And it's something that just really made sense and also kind of freaked me out because you know you see these aliens and it's like jesus what if that's what they really look like like super fucking tall man and just scary and like i don't know so that's my theory i hope you guys enjoyed this video um i'm gonna go so yeah um i know it wasn't really much of like I, whatever you know i can talk about it if i want don't judge me but i'm gonna go so peace wait wait peace